obviously, Min Jae scores a really nice goal. I mean, those are the goals that we expect from Min Jae. Um, guys worked hard. Guys defended. Um, I felt like we created some, some decent chances in this game. And I feel like we, at the end of the day, we kept ourselves alive for the playoffs. Right? And that's always been the overarching goal for us. It's in the first year to get into the playoffs. And, um, you know, we've had a roller coaster of a season. And hopefully, uh, you know, we, we had a roller coaster today, right? You know, being down 0 2, right? And the penalties and coming back and winning it. So, super important for us. For me, right, I mean, you know my faith, you know what it's all about, and I'm just sitting there praying, right? I'm just praying and hoping that, you know, God will bless us and give us this opportunity to keep playing. That's, that's it for me. I mean, that's like, you know, and, and, and talking to the coaches and talking to the players to try to, anybody's got ideas, if I've got ideas, just, just different things, right? But for me, it starts with my faith and really just like, just staying focused on, you know, what this is all about, right? What this is, the, import, the importance of the, these games, right? It's important to the fans. It's important to the club, you know, and, and you know, I understand this is a privilege to be here, and, and I just want to take it in and really make sure that I give everything I got and give the players the best chance, um, to, you know, to be successful. And they took it tonight, so. I hope the guys enjoyed it because, you know, I said to some of the guys, look, you, you're in this big stadium, realize that, potentially maybe you have the opportunity to play here. And that's what's in my head, right? I'm like, enjoy the moment, enjoy it, right? Imagine, you know, the better you do, maybe you're playing in a full stadium like this, right? And that, that's part of our, our development process of this club. And so for us to be here and to be walking on these grounds of a club that's an original club and for a family, the Kraft family that has poured a lot of money, a lot of time and a lot of energy into, the football, into football in America, it's important for us to come here. Yeah, John is really, as I say it over and over again, we really have two good goalkeepers, Burke and, and Gene, and both of them are uh, really important for us. And, you know, Gene continually, he has, he has one mindset, and that's to, to win games and do what he needs to do to win games. For us, right, I mean, I'm always a, a glass half, half full kind of guy, and so that's what we're going with, right? You know, we still control a lot of what we can do, and, you know, and that's what we're going to try to do. Um. I think we played well as a team. Um, um, we were hoping to get three points as a group, but I'm glad we at least took extra point back home. So I'm happy for the result today. Yeah, it was, it was a great feeling getting my first goal for Chattanooga. And yeah, hopefully I can get more. Yeah, so Milo played it out to me out, out wide, and I kind of took a touch inside, and I just saw an angle, and I just went for it. And yeah, I'm happy that <laughs> it was a goal. I think we did well as a group, like technically, and um, Fuddy's obviously playing right center back and I'm playing right wing back, and you know, he's really good at communicating with me, so having him on the right side with me helps, helps me a lot. Uh, yeah, it was crazy. The shootout was pretty crazy, and I'm really happy for Gene, and Gene, he's my roommate, and <laughs> he's one of my closest friends, so I'm really happy for him. Yeah, I think Gene, like, he's very confident, and he knows that he's gonna save at least two or three, so as long as we finish our chances, then I think we could win our games. Um, I think we have to win the next two games to go to playoffs, and I think we can win the next two games. Um, overall assessment was, it was good. I feel like we take a step in the right direction. Um, we just have to be more clinical in front of goal, but beside that, working over two points is better than, than none, so that's, that's a good step going for next weekend. For the most part, except on the goal, we dealt with everything that they throw at us. We just have, uh, we just have to stay disciplined, and stay within the game plan, not trying to do, not trying to do things individually. Just do things as a, as a collective. I think we're on the right path. I'm um, just relax, enjoy, it, like you know, because we're gonna make saves. We're gonna get scored on. You just we have to like stay focused. And uh, if you get scored on, and you're like, okay, the next one, okay, you read something, like you read the body language and what they do, and then you just based on that, because we got notes. But sometimes they know we have the notes, so they're also trying to fool us at the same time. So we're trying to deceive them. So. You know, it's a mind, it's a mind game. <laughs> have to be resilient going to Toronto. I don't know what the weather going to be like. I don't know what they're going to throw at us next weekend. So we just have to be ready for whatever they throw at us. Focus on them, get the three points there, and then we could focus at us at home on the six against uh, the Red Bull.